what exactly when Microsoft talk about Copilot in Microsoft Teams telephony, what does that mean? Or is Copilot in Teams phone? I see the terminology a lot, but I don't actually know what what that actually means. Yeah, let's go through it. So Copilot is there. It's both a product and a family brand, which obviously keeps it confusing, bless Microsoft. So if you go to copilot.microsoft.com, you get to the free consumer web base, a lot like ChatGPT, but Microsoft's flavor with Bing integrated. Yeah. If you've got a Microsoft 365 or Office 365 license, you get the same experience included in basically all your SKUs, but with commercial data protection. So same chatbot-like experience, and that is included in all the SKUs. So that's your base. But then you have Copilot for Microsoft 365, which is an add-on, $30 per user per month. So decent add-on in terms of total cost compared to the licensing. And that brings you Copilot into Word, Copilot into Outlook, Copilot into Excel, and Copilot into Teams, of course, and and a bunch of other products, Loop and others. And in Teams, it covers your asynchronous collab, your chat, your channels, It also covers your meetings, so you can do interactive meeting summaries, you can query, you can create bullets. And for Teams Phone, if you have that Copilot license, you can activate Copilot and transcription during a call, even a PSDN call, get a transcript, query the transcript, get summaries. So the kind of things you've probably seen a lot for AI in meetings, the same principle holds in phone and peer-to-peer VoIP calls if you've got that Copilot for Microsoft 365 license. 